Hey guys, this is Renzo. As you can see, we're going to work with RStudio, the development environment for the R programming language. On this video, I'll show you how to import records from three major statistical software, SPSS, Stata, and Minitab. We're going to import records from those statistical packages right into RStudio by using the built-in tools that RStudio provides. Finally, we're going to write down some some code on our programming language to do exactly the same, import records from those statistical packages right into our studio. But we're gonna focus on the Haven package, on this package. At my right side, on the Packages tab, as you can see, we already download and install Haven, Haven package. This package allows us to import data from SPSS, Stata, and SAS right into our studio. Before we get started, I'll show you the data we're going to work on. We go right to the SPSS graphical user interface. We got two columns, age and sex, and 20 records. We're going to import this data right into our studio. Next, a Stata a statistical software, statistical package. The same structure, age and sex, two columns, and 20 records. And finally, Minitab. Minitab this is statistical software, we're, we're going to import the data that you can see right here, right into our studio, two columns, age and sex. But I need you to focus right here. We save the Minitab worksheet as a CSV file because it's easier to import data from Minitab uh, under this format, C, uh, CSV. C, uh, CSV uh, it's easier to import this, this this data, this format of data, right into our studio. We get back to our studio. We go right to the menu bar, click on File. We go right to this section, Import Data Set, and we get started with with SP, SPSS. From SPSS, click on it. This window will show up. Import a statistical data. Click on Browse. We go right to this directory, RStudio Lab, and choose this file, this one right here. SPSS data 001, click on Open. Retrieving preview data, age and sex, and the 20 records. Down below, the name of the file, the specific format for the SPSS, SPSS file the code on our programming language that this graphical user interface will run. Click on Import. And that's it. As you can see, we already got the data from SPSS. We're going to do the same for Stata. Import data set. Go right here from Stata. The same window will show up again. Import statistical data. Click on Browse. Right here, our studio lab. This one right here is data, data 001. The extension of this file is DTA for, for Stata files. Click on Open. Retrieving preview data. We already got it. H and sex and the 20 records. The name of the file, DTA for Stata files, the extension and the R programming language code that this window will run. Click on import and the same. We got the data from SPSS, from Stata. We go right here again, file, import data set. But for Minitab, we'll go right here from text, read R. I already told you that we save the Minitab worksheet as a CSV file because it's easier to import the data from Minitab right into our, our studio under that format. Import text data, click on Browse, our studio lab, and this one right here, Minitab worship. Click on Open, retrieving, retrieving preview data, but it's not correctly structured. We have to go right here, the limiter, click on it, and choose semicolon. Retrieving preview data again, and finally we got it right. It's the same down below, the name of the file, and the code on our 
this window will, will run. Click click on import and we got it. We got it. We got it right. We already import data from SPSS, from Stata, and from Minitab using the built-in tools that our studio provides. Now we go right to the code on R. This one right here, yeah, we get it right. This one right here, it's code on R, on our programming language. We're gonna run to import data from SPSS right into our studio. We detach the Haven package right here. Let, let's clear the console, control L right here. We're gonna use the library command to call the Haven package. Run it. We already got it here. As you can see, it's been selected. We're gonna create this object on, on our studio. The data set SPSS, use the read sap command and this is the path, the right path, to find the SPSS file, select it, and run it. We got it, we got it right, and finally, let's check it out, the data that's, that's been sent to this object, to this variable. Run it, and we got it, by using code on our, our programming language. We're gonna do the same for the Stata, the touch haven package again, call it under under the library command, run it, we got it, and let, we're gonna create this one right here, data set stata, using the read stata command, and it's the, it's the same, it's the same directory and the right path and file. Select it, and run it, we got it right, and let's check it out using the view command. Run it, and that's it. We got it right. We got it SPSS, we got it Stata, and finally Minitab. But for Minitab, we have to remember that we are using an we're using an CSV file, so we have to uh, we have to tell it that we got two columns. Let's, let's correct this, it's in Spanish. Let's put it right here. Age and sex, let's correct this one right here. All right, so we got, we got this, this variable, Minitab Worship 001, the right path to find that, that CSV file but we are setting a specification for the two columns, age and sex, right? Age and sex, we are setting a specification, so we don't have any trouble when we started importing the data from Minitab right into our studio. So let's run it till right here. Run it, we got it right, and finally, Let's check it out, what we got on this object, on this variable. And we got it right. So we import data from SPSS, Stata, and Minitab right into RStudio by using the building tools that RStudio provides and by using uh, our programming language code. That's it for, uh, for today's video. Don't forget to subscribe your comments or doubts in the comment section down below. Thanks.